Hey, I'm Matt, and this is, video is going to be more towards the prepping side of things. Um, I apologize for the sound of the cars driving by, but uh, prepping-wise, you always need to be ready to walk home. Okay, you always need to be ready. People nowadays wear flip-flops as normal shoes and wear stuff that they cannot move in. Okay, so I'm wearing boots, which are not ideal for having to walk back home. But, you know, if I had to, I could walk. Luckily, it's only about a mile. We actually, nothing's wrong. We actually had to be in two places that both closed before six. And it was like 20 till. Uh, and they're both on opposite sides of town. Um, we had to get a prescription for Ronnie because he has strep throat again on the east side of town and the west side of town we had to be there with Austin to pick up his car because it was uh, getting some things fixed over $700 later Austin so uh, yeah he was getting some things fixed <laughs> and um, so we had to be in two separate parts of town sides of town before six and so I told my wife because the uh, place where we get the prescriptions is only like a mile from the house I told my wife I'm like look I'm gonna pull in here I'm gonna hop out and y'all leave me and I, I'm gonna get the prescription and then take off instead of us all waiting and uh, lucky I'm glad we did that because uh, it's the type of prescription that has to be mixed up when you get there and plus there was a line, so that took about, I don't know, 10 to 15 minutes. And that would have not given us enough time to get to the uh, mechanic shop by the time he got his car fixed. Or by the time to pick up his car to get it fixed. And if not, we would have to wait till tomorrow and my wife would have to take him to school again. And that's embarrassing having your mommy drop you off when you're a 17 year old in high school. So, uh, yeah, but, um, also a second thing, other than being able to, pre being prepared to hoof it at any time, um, make sure <laughs> anytime, don't ever try to hold it and say it like when you gotta go to the bathroom, don't ever try to hold it. Like if you're leaving one place, say, Oh, I got, you know, we'll swing by here and I'll be real quick because I really have to poop. And, uh, I just had to walk a mile while clinching, so because I was holding it. But second thing, okay, third thing, third thing is, okay, we have car keys, and our car keys, we tend to have, you know, one set of keys or two sets of keys or whatever, but we have the car keys, the van keys, which have our house key on them. Well, my wife had to be able to operate the van, so we needed, I needed to hoof it back to the house I carry my complete own set of keys. My wife has her own set of keys. I have my own set of keys. And then we have our vehicle keys, which our vehicle keys also have house keys on them. But we have our own complete set of keys. Anytime I leave the house, regardless if I'm driving or what, I always have this set of keys with me. So, but yeah, I made it to the house and I really gotta run in there and make it to the bathroom. So I will say, Goodbye.